Yeah, a warning seems most likely. Yes, I think you're right. Oh. Just try to get, I'm, I'm trying to get into character at all times. It's important. At this rate, I should play Baldur's Gate. After all, it won Game of the Year this year. One day. One of these days. But I got a whole backlog of games. The service medal you carry is an important reminder of your sacrifices and a crucial link to your past life. Your recovery has been slow but encouraging. Tell me, how's your personal life? I met someone last night. That's quite unusual. Tell me about this person. That's weird. A girl, she lives in my building. Ah, I wasn't expecting that. Who is she? She's just a kid. Maybe. Ah, I misinterpreted your meaning. You met a child in the third district. How strange. So it seems what some action movies do is if they want you to know something lore-wise, like something like Third District, instead of expecting you to remember it, they'll just beat you over the head with it as many times as possible. And honestly, for me as a viewer, that's been effective. Um, maybe my brain uh, has just been reduced to uh, fried mush because of just years of video game consumption, but... Um, I don't know. If nothing else, it's reminiscent of the action movies it seeks to replicate, so. Involved in the trafficking of club drugs. Lately guarded but surrounded by club goers. Extreme finesse required to eliminate without detection. Pathological liar. Do not speak to him. DJ Electrohead. Around the world. Alright, so here's a cute little stealth mechanic. See? And I like how uh, the animator actually went out of his way to make this guy dance. After all, he'd be pretty easy to see. And look, it's so easy for us to tell that the enemies can't hear. I wonder how we figure that out. And we know the enemy's field of vision. Look at that, we get so much information. With no text, no text required, just really good game design. And that floor, that light up floor, that was so cool. It's amazing. The detail, the level of detail that they put into these mechanically very simple levels. And there's DJ Electrohead up there in that, in that bubble. So now we're behind the scenes. And look, we just got our tutorial on how the cameras work. Oh no, we killed Strong Terry. <laughs> Poor guy. Well, he was in the way. Wrong place, wrong time, as they would say in the odd action movie. I feel like Jason Statham would say something like that. If anyone's typecasted, he is. Yeah, those turrets are mad annoying. Right, we get iframes. I don't even know who this call is from, but I, th I think it's from the, the psychiatrist. The evil Rick Moranis psychiatrist. With his... <laughs> little red suit yeah I'm I'm definitely losing my patience here there we go it's almost like like super meat boy because you, you really got to do it over and over and over again. And then maybe that one time you do it, you'll get lucky. Whoa. And I like that whole mechanic where you can sort of 
use the environment as smoke bombs. I, I'm, you get smoke bombs later on, but at the beginning, that's I think that's more fun using the environment. There you go. There we go. That was a close one. That was a close one from the looks of it. I might have had a down pat in the moment. And I guess that, that go indicator, that's sort of like Hotline Miami. It's like, okay, I killed everyone. Where do I go now? That is an intimidating number of enemies. How did I handle this one? <laughs> 